some believe that the first mutant was born thousands of years ago. And he's going to rise again. Apocalypse was born millennia ago. And he brought civilization to mankind, but in turn believed he was a god. Apocalypse has rejuvenated himself throughout history by taking the body of another mutant. And with each mutant he inhabits, he takes their powers. So he's acquired over thousands of years multiple powers. He can control all of us. Charles! You are all my children, and you're lost. He wakes up in 1983 to a world that, to him, is one giant corrupt civilization. Here we go. Action. To have a brilliant actor like Oscar Isaac embody the villain brings a very powerful complexity into the character. Together, we will cleanse the earth. Apocalypse has decided to take judgment on the world. So he's gathered a team of mutants to wipe out the human race. Everything they've built will fall! It's all of us against a god. Let's go to war. The X-Men Apocalypse is by far the largest X-Men movie. The powers of the villain are much greater, and the stakes are much higher. 